You now live with bipolar and you don't suffer from it as much anymore. How did you go about learning how to live with bipolar as opposed to suffering from it? Well, I do the necessary things, you know. I, I see a therapist and I have tons of workbooks like a nerd. I write music. I, I, um, I try to take what's going on and turn it into something beautiful the, in the best way that I can. The spotlight has definitely taught me so much. There are moments that I completely skipped out on. And the moment you get, I hate this word, famous, um, you kind of stay in that age range. I know that your twin goals are to destigmatize and democratize. What does that mean to you? I think it means um, how the public perceives what mental illness and mental health actually is. Why do we have to have negative connotations along with something that is just as important about your health as anything else? If you work on your body, um, you know, every day, and that's so important, why isn't your mental health just as important? But we're also amplifying these incredible professionals that do charge thousands of dollars an hour and being able to bring their information to the masses, to the people who can't afford that. So that's really the democratizing part.